Yeah, yeah, we can read some of these chats. Uh, Jam and Jim goes, ladies, if your best friend was dating a high value man you found attractive and she knew, how would you react if he asked, would you be interested in doing a throuple? Oh, if she asks. No. If she asks. Mm -mm. Your best no. friend was dating no. a guy. No. That makes no. sense. No. No. Be so Every, okay, all girls know the girl code. Yeah. yeah. That would Same be as so guys weird. know well, their not, bro code. Or, you know, y'all guys have girls a bro code that. even though you guys don't discuss no. it. You guys know it. Every girl knows their girl code. You guys know your bro that code. That friendship would be so yeah. good. Guys don't mind if they, if they don't majority, respect that, no, majority, it's because they're not your friend. Yeah. yeah. And they're into so, your man. I wish your best friend would try to my sharing. The girl code actually is an example of this, right? So she would know not to cross that boundary, right? Yeah. Well, isn't it funny? Recently, we just saw uh, Slim Jimmy and his girl were going through it because the girl code was she's friends with this girl, but apparently she was going to under her oh under this guy, the guise of a friend to her, but dealing with her man behind the scenes. Is that girl code to me? I don't know. It's gone. Not all girls are the same. As same weird. as all your guys girl is your girl. She will like, like you know. If you have respect for the person that you're dealing with, then yeah. you're not going to do it. But obviously, a lot of people don't have respect for people. They don't give a fuck. So they're going to do what they got to do to get their. Chris Brown made a song called "Well," do saying songs, he's hoes and loyal. It's very true, but hey, it's what it is. Goes for everybody. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. For girls. <laughs> Who do you think's more loyal, men or women? Uh, women. I would women. say women. Women? Mm -hmm. Yeah. To your friends. Men, men, men. But yeah. there are some loyal men out there. Let's go with a raise of hands here. Rare. How many it's of you how, how many of you think women are more loyal than men? Raise of hands. Uh, by nature. By nature. Yeah. yeah. Well that's what yeah. That's what yeah. I made the mistake of being loyal. Okay. So four of you think that women are more loyal. And then two of you think men are more loyal? None. Oh. If you had to pick one of the two in general. You have to. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, actually, my male friends are more loyal than my girlfriends. Literally Sorry. Not. Okay. So you think men are more loyal? Yeah. Okay. What about you? You think men are more loyal? I but girls are more supporters. <laughs> Is it the right support, though? Um, Depends. Or you can't trust anybody. Yeah. You can't. Period. That's why I keep like my uh, circle small. Okay. I don't call anyone like my friend. It's a All difference right. between, like, you know someone, no, that I'm you're friends sorry. with someone. But you trust your male friends more. Yeah. Who else trusts their male friends more here? I don't even have male friends. Uh -huh. Actually, no, I, I have more have... male friends no? and no. gay friends. Okay. I do. I do friends. trust my male friends more. You trust actually. your male friends more. I do. Interesting. I, do. <laughs> I trust my male yeah. friends more. people. Okay, what about you? What are you going to say? Um, I think in general, most women are not loyal. I think they're opportunistic when it comes to certain yeah, situations. I think that's a Miami girl. Miami. I think yeah. it's a single <laughs> Miami. Honestly. Hey, let let so her finish, too. please. Oh, sorry. Continue. Um, I think so, too. But, I mean, I guess everybody's different. I'm kind of just speaking in general. I, I think there are some women that can be extremely loyal, but I don't think that's the norm. One out of ten. Anybody agree with her point? No. Or disagree? You disagree? I disagree just because Why? I'm very new to the city, and I'm seeing that... We're talking about women in general, not I'm just for about, Miami. I know, I know, I know, but I'm just saying that I see, like, say if you're in a big city, girls see, like, what they can get from guys, and they build off that. So I feel like where you're from and wh what city you come from, that shows, like, how you act. People oh, here, they're, they're opportunities. So, like, this Agreed. is a big city, and this is like a big opportunity. So, people want to get what it's they not can a get. City is how well you were raised. So, you claim well, no, clearly people no. so are raised confused. here and acting a damn fool. You so, can get influence, which is different. You just made the, oh, yeah, you said you that influence. men. You said that women are more loyal, but now you're making the argument that women are. Uh, sorry, you made the argument that women are more loyal, but now you're saying women are less loyal because of opportunity in Miami. Um, <laughs> I'm confused. I'm just saying. In the general idea, what do you think? But what you just said. In the general hurts your idea, argument. I do think females can be more loyal. Just because I've seen how my mom has act, I'm uh -huh. just gonna say that. Okay. But since I had been here, I'm just saying, like I've seen like the. You initiated the breakup, though. You said your parents were separated. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wrote that down. <laughs> mm. <laughs> they did break up. Yeah, she I wrote said it down. It was complicated. So who initiated it? <laughs> your mom, right? Because my dad wasn't doing uh, what he had to do as a man. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Uh, my dad wasn't doing what he had to do as a man, uh, yeah. so my mom had to yep, end yep, it. Yep, yep, yep. He wasn't being a man. Exactly. So, uh, Hold up, daddy. I love you, though. Yeah. Hold up. Uh, Hold up. So, <laughs> anyway, um, I think that men are way more loyal than women, and the reason why I say that is because women are naturally programmed to not be loyal, and I think it's in your guys' biology, and you have to be. You have to go for the strongest man, the man with the most resources, the man that could provide you 
and offspring, the safest life and safest situation. So women naturally tend to cling to the highest status men because they have to by survival. Remember that feminism and women entering the workforce is a relatively new thing. You're still biologically wired from thousands of years of programming to be with the strongest man. True. So women in their own nature are not, not designed true. to be loyal. It's For me, true. it's definitely true. For me, it's not true because... Hold on. Okay. I want you to repeat what you just said a second ago. <laughs> not true? Yeah. No, no, no. Before that. For me. What do you mean? You, what, you said your male friend. What did you say a second loyal. before? Right, what did you say before that's not true? Oh, that I trust more men. No, no, like, no, no, no. What did you say before you said it's not true? Hmm. Oh, <laughs> wait, 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 what? It's okay, I got, I got you, you said it's for me, it's not true, yeah. you said for yeah, me, for it's, me not it's not true. true, yeah, okay, does that, how does that defeat my argument if I'm saying in general? No, I mean, in general, for me, it's not true because I can tell you this. My mom on, raised me by did herself. You, did, did you not hear yourself just a second ago? Yeah, for me, it's not true. Okay, in general. In general. In general. In general. I, made a, I made an argument based on generalities. Okay. Can you be the exception hey, to the rule? you're right. Fantastic. You want to hear that? But you're right. It, Sorry, well, my bad. No, he's not right. Everybody's fucked up in this world, bro. Men are women. Let him know. Like... I understand everybody. How has was I wrong? Whenever just you have a different you're opinion, you're, you're not right. Your Whenever you, you hear what you want to hear, opinion? you're That's right. Your opinion, and I have my opinion. I just state a biological fact to Where back up my opinion. You got opinion. proof? He said biological. Wait, okay. That's wait, 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 wait. Okay. That's before strong. I continue, What's can you? Can you wait, wait, wait. Before hold I on, continue, hold on, hold on, before I continue, can you repeat what you said? One at a time. So you don't even know what I said. No, I do. But I want you to repeat what you said. Can you repeat what he said? No, I want you to repeat what he said so I can. Continue what I'm saying. I want you to repeat what you said. So you said I'm wrong, but I'm you can't even recall wrong. what I said. I never said you're wrong. You said that's my opinion. You tried to make it, you tried to bring it down a bit. And I said, well, what I said is she can my, say this my opinion, as you would say, or my take, it's based on biological fact. He's just trying to make you. F no, no, no. No. I'm, uh, no. I mean, like, go ahead. How am I incorrect? He definitely is. Yeah. And then, and then you said biological. Shot. That's that's strong. You said I got a. Yeah, it's a biological provider. fact. So it is a biological your, fact. It where's is the biological and that's fact. What we look that's what I'm Where's your stats? Where's Look at it. Where's okay. the strong? Let's go ahead and have fun with this then. Do you want Bring a man that's hold on? Do you want a man that's stronger providers. than you? Providers. Of course. Yeah, I do. do you want a man that makes what more money than you? For? I do. Do you want a man that's taller than you, if possible? But you know how weird. Stop interrupting. One at a time. Yes, Dad. Yeah. Okay. Someone. I don't mind a short. Go short. Yo. So. One mic at a time. Yo. So you want a guy that's stronger than you? Mm -hmm. Makes more money than you. Yes, mm -hmm. sir. You want a guy that's more competent and... than you, smarter than you, and can teach you things. Mm -hmm. Congratulations, you just validated what I just said. But what did you say? I didn't Wait, have what? a chance to answer. Women want a man who's better than them in every regard. It's a biological urge. And then mm -hmm. I asked you, what do you want in particular? And you agreed with my points. Okay. Mm -hmm. So how am I wrong? That's a fact. You know how, <laughs> but you okay. said, and okay. you proved it with your own liking. So I, you, all right, you're right. I attributed it to you. Do you know how you're rare right, it right. is? To Incredible. Find, this is scary, bro. Do you yeah, know how scary. rare it is to find a man to put a woman in her feminine, for her, to put a feminine, to put her in her feminine like self? Like a lot of feminine, we don't want cocky. A lot of girls are in their independent well. era because a lot of men aren't stepping up to the plate to put them in the position to make them feel like a woman. Okay. Understandable. You know you, what did I mean? Did you not listen to what I said? I earlier. did. I heard. 100%. What did I say? You said that a hundred percent, like men. Have more of a competent feel because for women, I know I'm not going to talk. <laughs> no, what did I say? Go ahead. No, it's okay. It's okay. Because you made an argument right right now based on what's going on contemporaneously, right? Like what's going on in today's society. I said since the beginning of time, women have linked themselves to the strongest men. So what does that have to do with anything? For survival. I'm saying in today's era, true, there's not a lot of strong men. But that does not change your biological wants and needs. Yeah. Just because there's a lack of strong men. If anything, it makes your want for strong men. Of course I want men a strong man. Even stronger. You don't think I want a strong man? So then why are you arguing men, with because me? Because a lot of these so men in this fucking generation are strong men. Hold on. So you, yo, what do you mean? Yo, ladies. What the fuck? I made the point. I said, yo. What? <laughs> let, let's go from, <laughs> from step one. Okay? Let's go from step one. Okay. I said, men are more loyal because our wants in women are not basically tied to what that woman could provide for us. Mm -hmm. Women, however... Your wants and needs in men are directly tied to what that man can provide for you, okay? Because since the beginning of time, women have needed men to survive. It's only in modern-day society, which you're complaining about right now, and then you mentioned with your single mom, that women are able to provide for themselves. But for a very long time, <laughs> women have not been able to provide for themselves, which is why women still want a guy that's taller than them, stronger than them, more confident than them. And she just admitted a second ago, and taller. most women do. As most I didn't women say do, taller because I said, can do a short man. Short man, regardless, it's, I'm still more correct. than what a taller stop, man has. Stop, 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 be quiet. No. Okay. 
What? Who sure you won? You said what? I said be quiet. No, but I said no. No to what? No, you say to yes, you. daddy. You say yes all the yes, time. Yes, daddy. Yeah. And then let, let me yes. make this clear, man. If I tell you to be quiet, just be quiet because I'm talking. I'm making a point. It's a podcast. This but isn't like a regular to. conversation. Like, get out, man. Yeah, well, just get out of here, bro. Then. Just leave, bro. Like, like, man. Man. Why are you here then? The fuck is this no, shit, man? Ridiculous. No, no, no. You ain't just about to leave. You're leaving. That's fine with me. Just leave straight. Put your shoes on outside. Yeah, man. Put your shoes on outside. Just leave. Yeah. Turn a quad of the show, man. Ridiculous. Let's get out. I apologize. I don't know her name. I don't know her name get because, out, yeah, that was disrespectful. What was disrespectful? Her. Who was this chick? Nigga, you were yeah. too. Why? Oh. Screaming out lips. I'm not. <laughs> a... No, I wasn't screaming nothing. Yes, you nothing. were. Nigga, I saw you. Yeah, you were making Twice. comments on the side okay, too. I heard you. <laughs> All right, move. Comments. Ladies, so, move forward. That's uh, have anyway, a going back to what I was saying. He's making a point and I'm Women are less loyal than men because your wants instinctively can't make you loyal. You are loyal to the strongest man that you can attract. That's all I'm saying. And also, if you can't find them, you become that man for yourself. And your own argument saying that Probably. men don't provide no more. That proves my point. Well, okay. Your generation is different than the guys that are in our generation now. You guys are alpha men that you guys, right? You guys so you guys put your guys in the category that you guys are alpha men. A lot of our men are beta. They don't act like what you guys think that you guys are right yeah so we we just can't well, like i can't do that bro like men in our generation are beta men they, they're pussies bro like i'm sorry i haven't well, met a man to make me put myself in my feminine era to make me not that does not refute the fact that i mentioned that women are less loyal than men because they yearn for these instincts that you're mentioning right you're, now yes, which are hard to find you're proving I have. our point wait, 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 because i haven't met a man to put me in my feminine era i had to step up to the plate to be independent right and you I, became the man that you wanted yes, to attract yeah yeah which yeah. isn't good either by the way you don't, I don't think really, your woman really, will be more loyal than you i'm in my peaceful era she's loyal to me because of who i am what she's loyal to me because who i am like his status nah. because of what he provides uh, she just likes the clown. he became like i'm not like one of these delusional fucks and says oh yo like uh she likes me just because of me and all this other shit it's like no obviously there of uh, me me there's a com components to that right like my status how i behave how i carry myself etc leadership qualities competence all these things matter but she'll loyal to me because of my behaviors and what i do and what you think i provide that? you don't think she'll just be loyal to you if you didn't have all this no, no, being dead ass serious. No, because women are not like men. They're not programmed to be like men. When, women look for their best options, which is fine. I don't get mad at biology. I accept biology. I think she probably would if she looked. <clears throat> you don't think? Look. Well, it may be finite, though. Yeah, it's like possible. it might be a t a t on a time clock, time whatever. Clock. Like, uh, I accept reality that women want men that can provide certain things. And it's a bunch of things. It can't just be money. If you just provide money, then you're just a sucker and she don't respect you. Right. It can't just be good dick because then she, you can, she can't see you long term. And it can't just be like you being assertive because she'll, you know, she might get uh, annoyed by you being assertive when you don't have anything to back it. So, see, this is what I hate when we got to fucking do the whole uh, musical chair musical shit. Musical chairs. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> it's so funny. You're proving our point just by arguing. Yeah. And it's like... I don't know, man. It's yeah, just, it's not arguing. It's just different opinions. I hope you guys know that. we're not it's arguing. Same. There's no different opinion. You just oh. validated my my stance. You agree with us? Thank you. <laughs> okay. All I'm saying is that there's pussy men in this generation, and obviously you guys might not categorize your guys' self as that, but we have to deal with a lot of beta men who pop to put us in our independent women era. And I, I agree. We that does not refute the argument on the show that women are not naturally loyal. I never loyal said like you men. were wrong never said you were wrong so then why are you making that comment if it's not to i'm just saying my opinion <laughs> i can be quiet now my bad i'm sorry <laughs> continue your song no you're missing a point <sighs> you know what never mind like you just went off on a whole other tangent from the topic at hand <laughs> what's going on tonight bro like you gave an excuse for why women are more masculine but that's not the argument that we were making uh, i mean i agree with you that that's why but like that's not what we're i'm missing I'm not gonna lie, bruh. 35 looking good right now. What 35? Yeah. What do you mean? What's 35? To get in a relationship? Oh, I mean... oh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, <laughs> oh, okay. I mean, she's the only girl that gets it on this panel, bro. She doesn't bro. speak. Uh, do you watch show? Maybe you too. I do. Uh, okay. Oh, that's good. That's good. Oh, but that's okay. good though. That's good. That's good. So when you say muted, you're good. What's 35? I want to know. Her. No, her. My age. It's not about being muted. Oh. It's about it's about if it's you're gonna make a point. In, like, Make it make sense. Like, for example, I gave a general statement and then you went ahead and responded with, for me, no, and then in general, and th that doesn't make sense. Because 
we we think different, which is doesn't like make it wrong or right. We're we two different species. Different. Male and women think so differently. You're speaking on a species? fact that probably I don't care. <laughs> species. So if you don't care, then why would you respond? No, to I it? didn't say care, share. Like we probably we don't like uh, share like the same opinion. Like it does it doesn't make it me like wrong or right or you wrong or right. We just think different. I think you think wrong because I gave a fact and then you went ahead and attributed it to yourself and you gave a personal because anecdotal. of the statistics or something like that. It it is based on statistics. If I make a factual claim. Right. In general. Mm -hmm. And then you go ahead and you say, well, for me, that's not true because X, Y, Z. It doesn't change the fact that what I said was still correct. And then your Mm -hmm. situation might still might just be a one off situation. But I'm willing to bet that it's not, because if your mom had the choice to have a man by her side, she would prefer that. It just didn't work out that way. Yeah. And I still have high standards like, you know, dating a man. For example, my dad didn't provide like a single cent for us. I, okay, Bro. so you have high but standards still, in still, he, like, yeah. showed me love. So you do realize by you saying that you have high standards in men, you just proved my point again. Yeah, I do. I never said no. I never I never said no, I don't have high standards. You ask anyone else but me. Yo, chat, what's going on tonight, bro? I, I, I'm confused. Can I ask a question? <laughs> yeah, sure. Do you think that, like, with men, the more money they make, they don't care about what the women do? Or do you think that they still care? Karen, what way? Like, say that a girl has OnlyFans, right? And say that a girl has OnlyFans, and mm-hmm. they meet a guy that is very established and makes a lot of money and who is very confident in himself. Do you think that that man will still care that his woman does what she does to make her money if he has his own life built? Yes. He's yes. absolutely going to care even more so because mm-hmm. now his reputation is going to be tarnished by being with a girl that does that type of work. Would you, mm-hmm. another question. If you met a girl that does OnlyFans and you make the money that you do and she was willing to change her life for you and say, I'm willing to drop everything that I do, OnlyFans, including porn, everything, as long as you can take care of me and I can, like, su- what is it, submit to my feminine role, would you take a woman like that? No. Because of her history? Yeah, she no longer qualifies. What's your qualifications? No porn, no OnlyFans? Yeah, I mean, she can't She can't be a thought, man. Like, th- So her body count, what does her body count have to be for not to be a thought? Well, here's the thing. Girls that have high body counts have certain behaviors, okay, and they do certain things. Uh, and if she exhibits those behaviors, because I never listen to what it, when a girl tells me, oh, my body count is this, I don't mm-hmm. believe them. I go off of how they behave, how they move, their past, et cetera. That will tell you the real truth. Right. So I just don't commit to girls that have certain behaviors. I have a six-month to one-year vetting period where I see a girl, and um, – if she doesn't align with like what my belief systems and what she does, it's just I just never commit to her. So when will you commit to your girl? Because how long have y'all been long distance? I mean, I'm no, sorry, she's not here. long distance. She's here. Oh, she's, she's, really she's here. <laughs> well, she's not here right now, but but oh. she's usually here. We've we've known each other for a while, but like I mean, she exhibited traits that I was like, okay, this is this is good. Um, but one of the biggest ones is like you don't want a girl that's going to embarrass you in the future from her past. And unfortunately, mm-hmm. like, I don't think women understand that. Like what you do in your past can absolutely impact your man's future. Mm-hmm. I mean, this is pretty simple. When you go to buy a car, do you, do you want a high mileage car or low mileage? Do you well. just compare a girl to a car? <laughs> room, room. You're a misogynist. I never said that. What? That's my stuff. Like, What's yo. wrong with you? Stop. No, don't turn tables. It's a general question. <laughs> yeah, I'll compare women to cars because that's how we view you guys. I mean, at the end of the day, you want to pull up in a car that has low mileage, brand new, not look like shit, not have a bunch of drivers, not have a bunch of bad car facts. Yeah, because if I'm going to go ahead and go on the journey of a cross-country trip, which is marriage, by the way, of driving from New York City all the way to Los Angeles, I want to have a reliable, good car that's not going to give me problems. But if I get with a chick that has a bunch of mileage and all this other crap, you do. I you, might not you make it. I might not there. make it. I might not make it to Los Angeles. Why would I want to? Yeah, the rentals are in between. But I want but my car that has a title on it, I want to make sure that car is good. So what's wrong with the title car? No, no. You park it at the hotel, the fancy hotel. You go to the casino at a rental and come back home. Uh, And then, you know. Is it just to fulfill needs? Is that what it is? Might be an itch. Obviously, it's it's not emotion or anything when you, like, have fun with, like, side chicks. Is it just to provide sexual needs? Yeah, because your woman will never be able to provide you variety. That's why that's the that's the th- that's the biggest issue that women can't under- get over is that men don't cheat because we just want to cheat because we want to hurt our girlfriends. No, it's because your girlfriend can't offer you variety, unfortunately. Like the whole platter, right? 
No, As it's in, just see. You might say, you know what, I want to have sex with an Asian girl, and your girl's black. Or you might say, you know what, I want to have sex with a black girl, and your girl's white. Women simply can't offer the variety that men yearn for. I mean, would you so be open? Would you be open if your girl said, like, yo, let's have a threesome? I wouldn't do it with my main girl ever. Why? That well, carries either. problems. That's you, like, you that's can't either. properly drive two cars at the same time. You can't. <laughs> so I mean, so you, I mean, today, today, you want, Teslas, today you want a Ferrari. T tomorrow you want a Porsche. Tomorrow you want a Lamborghini. What if they're two Teslas? Huh? Huh? And Elon Musk is driving them. I'm just saying. Autopilot that bitch. I'm just saying. Look, I get what you're trying to do here, but uh, you lost. I'm, no, yeah. I'm not even trying to fight. I'm just trying to understand y'all. Like, no, you don't care. You don't I really care. I really don't give a fuck. I know you that's, don't. That's why. Who's <laughs> three, man? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I just like your right. 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 It's funny that you're trying, though. It's fine. Yeah, very interesting. Thank you, guys. Um, you guys are do you have sweet. any questions? <laughs> I don't. I'm just... Uh, observing? Observing. Yeah. There's not much that I agree <laughs> with and some of the things they're saying, so... Mm. I prefer to just. Girl, uh, I could say a lot. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. This is great. Fantastic.